Hi, I'm William. This is the Wine Room at Putnam Market, and we're continuing our little exploration of Burgundy with the aid of a couple of bars of Toblerone, obvious, you might think. So this, as we now know, if you've been following intently for the last three weeks, this, as you know, is the Cote d'Or. This is where the Pinot Noir and the Chardonnay is grown for the famous vineyards, or most of them, I should say, because there's another famous white wine which comes from Burgundy, which comes from Chablis, whose name, as you well know, was, um, was taken for some very inferior white wine produced in the United States. Now, Chablis is actually quite a long way away from the Cote d'Or. I mean, if you were to think of me as being, say, Paris, Chablis is maybe 50 miles closer to Paris than the Cote d'Or. And here, of course, you get those famous steely wines made from Chardonnay. And again, it's divided into Grand Cru, Premier Cru, Chablis Appellation Petit Chablis, and the quality varies greatly, and the quality varies greatly in Chablis for precisely the same reason it varies in the Cote d'Or. It's all about the slope, it's all about the sunshine, it's all about the drainage and the geology. And those sites which get the best aspect and the most sunshine produce the most famous wines, and that's what you're paying for.